Cal. What a freaking view. Dang, what a view. Dang. All right, the cops are already on their way to your vehicle down there by the beach. Cops are coming. Are they? Yeah. 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 Welcome back to the channel, guys. Slop Squad here. Look at that. Four pit bikes in the back of the truck. That definitely calls for a good time. Let's get on this adventure, boys. We're about to head out riding. Before I go, I thought it might be time to give her a freaking bath, cause look at this sh Look at this sh Been treating her like garbage for the, for the longest time, so. Jesus Christ. Okay, now she's looking decently clean. Let's pull this nasty ass air filter and carb off and do some more cleaning. All right, boys, carb's on. It's all clean. Let's give her a start. Make sure I didn't ruin anything. We're gonna go right up there. You see that rock? It's a rock. Though. Parking like a professional right in this ditch. I don't wanna ride a small one. <laughs> I gave you every opportunity to ride it, and that's my turn. Fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's so short. I'm not comfortable with it. Yeah, it is short, huh? What you're holding in your hands right now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 that guy's watching up there. I don't know what he's doing. He's probably gonna call the cops soon. It must be like a private road or something. I don't know. That guy was like giving us a death stare or something.
good. And wheelie is the, probably the easiest of all the bikes yeah, and the right. smoothest. That's fine, but it's a little rough on a small bike. Yeah, the bumps are hard. Bible verses on rocks, that's so cool. Yeah, hey. so like, if you go on this trail, you'll see that the whole time. That's pretty awesome. Looks like there's a Karen situation going on. <laughs> you better get out of here. Hurry up, someone's behind you. Thousand is three hundred dollars a piece. You had, you, you, you could, you. For fines for trespassing. All right, the cops are already on their way to your vehicle down there by the gate. It said no motorcycles, authorized vehicles only. You went to three different people's properties at one Fred Georgia. So I suggest you guys turn around and leave now. We're just gonna get more costly. What is it? Cops are coming. Are they? they yeah. Call? Yeah. It's uh, some the guy I think that was standing there. Flashback. That guy's watching up there. I don't know what he's doing. He was freaking out. He was shaking and like being weird. Is this like a, I thought this was like a public land. I don't know. It says. Private property. I don't know. Yo, if we're on public, I'm I'm gonna check. If we're on public land, he can screw off. Yeah. He said we're getting fined. Yeah, he's like it's three hundred dollars a piece for trespassing or some shit. I don't think cops are gonna come for something like this. <sighs> These Karens never let us have fun, man. I say if we're gonna trespass, we're already getting trespassed, so might as well just, just go. Yeah, let's just go finish. It's right here. Right, yeah, yeah, whatever. Get in trouble. We get in trouble. <laughs> tree in the way. Is it pretty close? Yeah. Just gotta hike the rest of the way. Just look at that. It's dope, dude. We just try to have some fun, okay? Why people try to be such Karens? <laughs> My truck is there, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, more Bible verses. Sick. I know it's fine. I know it's fine. Come get a three hundred dollar ticket with me. I've never had any problems here, but we always came on foot. So, so funny. So one time I was hiking with Arkady at Liberty Lake, and he's like, "Hey, you know what? I'm trying to like challenge my fears and stuff. So I kind of want to walk by myself for a little bit. He was already like us. And so uh, I'm like, all right, I'm gonna run a mile." And you can like basically test your fear, you know, like by walking by yourself when it's dark. And he's walking, I'm, I started ran a mile ahead of him. Maybe half a mile, I remember. He was like, I'm gonna wait. And then, like, I'm waiting for like 15 minutes. I find the same coming. And I'm behind these bushes. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> 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 he's so loud. He's a big ass dude. <laughs> <laughs> like, 
No, he's like, he's like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> I guess Arcadi, like Arcadi that. he's just been put on blast, bud. <laughs> Holy cow. What a freaking view. Dang, what a view. Dang. That's Luby Lake. No? That is crazy. Wow, dude, this is crazy. Y'all need to get on your pit bikes and go find places like this. This is freaking breathtaking. Wow. Shoot, dude. All this is private? How? How is this private? This is just crazy. Freaking crazy. I'm telling you. Time to get out of here. Last look at the place. Oh, let's go. Kind of heard some branches breaking and stuff down by our bike. So, fingers crossed our bikes are still there. Oh, yeah. That was my pinky. Pinky toe. Oh, bikes were there, so that's a good sign. All right, we're heading out. Poked out. Tweaker is not by my car, dude. We honestly thought this was all like public land. At least this area, but I guess it's not. Well, maybe this place is, but I don't know, bro. I have no idea. Hey, my bike keeps dying every time I let go of the throttle. Where are my friends at? Oh, what the hell? I just hit a freaking tree with my leg. Yo, <laughs> Yo, don't piss on yourself, Peter. What's wrong with you? I'll turn off this right on you. <laughs> the problem he's driving a suzuki four-wheeler what kind of crap is that man where the grizzly at hmm where the cops at didn't show up i don't even show up oh, they're gonna show up you guys do know that it's all private property right uh, uh not okay. this road you can't bring any motorized vehicles past the gate are you aware of that uh, I know up top it's not private property. You know what? Up top, it's not private property. Yeah, you still can't ride your little bikes here, and you can't. And you had to get in through this way. I'm taking it because you're parked here. There's signs all over that says no motorized vehicles, unless I don't know it. And you own land up there. My dad owns property up there. Oh, he does. What's his name? His name is Joe. Uh, his first name is Joe. Does Joe have a last name? Joe Mama. <laughs> no, I was just joking. It was a joke. Okay. Like, <laughs> and I know up there it's not private property. I'll be up top. It's all I, who, who told you that? Uh, it's it in a it's it's state park up there property. by uh, Michael Pete. It even has hunting regulations up there. Stimson Lumber Company, Goatee oh. Land, Wine Coops. Yeah, Stimson Lumber, they allow That's motorized vehicles. Property. They don't allow motor vehicles uh, on there. I go hunting four wheeling at Stimson up north all the time. Did we do any harm? Well, all we did was basically go to that, uh, that peak with the Bible verses. Uh -huh. I, yeah, wanted, I wanted to show them. That's it. That's all. That's, in Idaho, that's called criminal trespass. It's a crime mm -hmm. and a criminal act. The first offense is 300 bucks. Second offense, 500. Third offense, $1,000. I mean, you guys are walking to call the cops. I, 
We didn't. We're you. not oh, trying to do anything to you guys. So if we're coming off the wrong way, I apologize. But we were just trying to get to the view and enjoy that view. One thing we're talking to you, and he's the only one that took off his helmet. Do you have a helmet? He on? doesn't have a helmet. You don't even have a helmet here. I'm giving you props. <laughs> you, you... A winery place. I can go through here or no? Not with your bikes. This is good information. <laughs> Girl comes up and she says she lives down the hill. And the guy that came to talk to us, they call him Terra Steve. <laughs> because anybody who passes around that, he like terrorizes them or like harasses them. <laughs> to the point where they had to call the cops on him. And the cops said that uh, they actually don't own the land, so they can suck it. So basically, she said it's state land, didn't she? Yeah. I'll go back, I don't care. Dude. <laughs> Next time we park yeah. somewhere down here, and yeah. then we ride yeah, up. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, the road's not private. Yeah, I think the road's not private. So why is it unauthorized? So maybe they put the sign up? That's what I'm, I'm kind of thinking. Why did they? They, they, they probably cook meth over there, bro. That's what only everybody go in their business. <laughs> My question is, they sat at the bottom for over so an hour. Hard. I know. <laughs> <laughs> for what? Like, for what? What are you going to do? So what? <laughs> they just sat there recording me. I'm like, so they just leaving her. All right, guys, to make a long story short, I know the audio kind of sucks in the end, but I wanted to throw that in there. Basically, we go up this place, this old uh, logging road. These guys follow us saying we're on private property. We're going to get fined. We're like, whatever, if we're getting fined, we're going to keep going and then we'll come back. They waited for like two hours for us by our truck. Like how you got to be really, really bored with your time to wait for us that long by our truck. Then the other guy pulls up to our truck with a gun on his side and a knife like to intimidate us or something like, ooh, you're so scary. Here's the thing, that's an old logging road. It's it's not private property, it's state property. And I read online about this uh, from a lot of people, these guys harass everybody. And even that lady that lived down there drove up at the end and you couldn't hear anything, but she basically told us that we can go through there and that this guy's name is Crazy Steve. And basically she gave us thumbs up and that, those guys can screw off. They were pretty much lying to us. They probably put the signs on that gate in front of the road not to let people go through because I don't know why they're really bored with their life or something like that. On top of all the lies of everything, these guys were going back and forth, like saying, oh, you only if you have property or you know somebody and you get permission, then you can ride your bikes through here. And then we're like, okay, so if I get permission, can I ride our bikes through here? No, you can't ride your bikes through there. Only you can only walk. And it's like, okay, then why were you riding your four wheel through there? Basically, these guys' story didn't add up. They're a bunch of jokers, bro. So yeah, end the story. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Share it with your friends and don't forget to follow us on our other socials, TikTok and Instagram at Slav Squad TV. See you guys next time.